Leon was born in Bend in his home about 93 years ago. And then he had two sisters. By the time we got to high school, he was in track. And so I remember going to the track meets and watching him. He had no idea who I was. And I always liked him at, from a distance. We were coming out of church, my mother and brother, and uh, it was absolutely shocking beyond speech. Well, they were making three or 400 trips a day into Tokyo with the B-29s firebombing that city. And we were protecting those guys as they were coming back. But as they were coming back, two Bettys fall. And we were flying the F4U1C that had 20 millimeter cannons on it. But what they hadn't told us at the time was that the 20 millimeters hadn't been tested for altitude. But my wing leader and I took off after this one. And I thought it was funny because when as we came down through there and, and he should have been strafing up the length of that fuselage, not a bullet was coming out of his airplane. And so when I followed him in, I strafed the airplane fuselage from one end to the other and set the uh, port wing on fire. And it started down. But as we flew up and around again and joined up, he just told me his guns were broken and it was mine to do. So I came back down around and followed him down, gave it another burst to make sure that it was going to go into the water and it did. On the way back to the Shangri-La, Everybody landed and I came around, got a good landing, landed on the number one, between the number one and two arresting wires and suddenly nothing happened. I thought, boy, it just instantaneously I knew I hadn't caught a wire. And what had happened was that the tail hook had broken and was just hitting the deck like that, flopping back up so it never caught a wire at all. So I immediately applied the brakes skidded all the way up the deck until it hit the barrier, went up on the nose and over on one wingtip. Another episode was when we went over into Honshu at some point, and in the harbor of Curry, there was the battleship Haruna, and we had that mission to destroy that battleship. We made the first run. The fighter, fighter pilots made the first run on it and strafed that battleship from one end to the other and, and released our rockets. And the guys that were coming in with the thousand pound bombs, the fighter bomber group, hit it hard enough, but the, the harbor floor wasn't very deep. And the battleship settled down to the harbor floor and the only thing that was left above water was the cannons on that battleship. June 29th, 1946, we were married. Our marriage has been compassionate and loving. We produced three beautiful children. We've been married 70 years, 70 years in June, going on 71. It was a great life, and a great marriage, and a wonderful wife. And we had a wonderful family. <laughs>